Hi, my name is Riley and this is my sustainability project. For my project, I decided to pre-make packaged meals in the most sustainable way possible. There are a variety of methods I used to ensure that my packaged meals were made sustainably. The first was to shop local. I bought groceries from markets that were known to sell produce that was grown locally and also meat that was raised locally. I got my grocery list and my meal plan and now I'm headed to the store. The second was to choose foods that are considered highly environmentally friendly. I chose to cook with chicken because chickens are far more efficient in converting feed into meat protein and that reduces the amount of lamb, fertilizer, and energy involved, resulting in a light carbon footprint as compared to beef or pork. I chose to cook with peas because peas naturally fix nitrogen in the soil, which eliminates the need for synthetic fertilizer and will leave the soil rich with nutrients after harvest. I also chose to cook with potatoes because potato plants produce natural pesticides and fungicides that reduce the need for synthetic chemicals. Potatoes are also water efficient crops, which decreases groundwater depletion. Once I had all the ingredients, I found the recipes on Pinterest and got cooking. We have our ingredients for our pasta and it's time to start cooking. Hi, so I'm about to start step two, which is just making the food and following the recipe. There can be multiple steps depending on what recipes you choose to do. But for right now, what I'm doing is I'm about to cut up this chicken and marinate it for teriyaki chicken bowls. And I already have potatoes in the oven to make gnocchi. So our chicken is in the fridge marinating now. And now I have our potatoes to start making our gnocchi. And I have to take the skins off. Okay, so right now I'm making my gnocchi dough. I've got my flour and mashed potatoes. I'm about to make an egg basket for my beaten egg. Just one. All the gnocchi dough is rolled and cut. Now it's time to make the sauce. So our first pre-made meal is almost done. I just have to add basil. I got a uh, basil from the supermarket, but my mom also has a basil plant, but I don't want to take all the leaves off of it. So I'm gonna do both. So now we're packaging our pre-made meals to eat another day for lunch or even for dinner. And I have eight containers here, uh, two smaller ones and six bigger ones. And they're all microwavable safe, so you don't really have to use any other dishes once you want to eat them. And they're all reusable. Here we are, our six pre-made vegetarian pasta meals to be eaten in the next week, probably. Now we're meal prepping for meal number two, and I'm about to put the rice in the container for the teriyaki chicken bowls. The last method I used to make sure that my pre-made meals were made as sustainably as possible was to package them in reusable containers. Reusable containers promote zero waste and also reduce the harmful effects that plastics and other disposables have on the environment. Once the meals were done, I packaged them in the reusable containers and placed them in the fridge. You could also place them in the freezer depending on how long you want to store them for. What I like about the pre-made meals is that you can portion them out to how much you want to have at a certain time. This makes sure that you don't waste any food. So we've got all our prepared meals that will last us for probably a week and a half, all in microwavable safe containers and reusable containers. See you soon. Hi, 
I'm back. It's the next day and I'm eating my pre-made gnocchi meal. I already put it in the microwave and warmed it up. So basically with meal planning, you're essentially creating a food waste reduction strategy because you have pre-made meals already portioned out. So you're not gonna waste that much food. And you also spend uh, less money on food because you plan it out. And you can also spend less trips, like, or you can have less trips to the grocery store. And then um, also you can design healthy meals for yourself that can one, be good for you and two, be good for the environment.